Hello guys and welcome to a new brand video and today I'm going to show you how to not go in idle or uh, being uh, seen as a way in Microsoft Teams desktop application. So the first thing that we need you to do now is to open your Microsoft desktop clients and then you need to connect with your Microsoft Teams account or Outlook account and then just follow the simple steps. So after you succeed on uh, running your application you will need to go to the settings or to your account settings and basically all you need to do is uh, to click on uh, our uh, profile picture and here you will find the set status message so basically those are your status and you are available then set status message and then just add anything hello but the most important thing that you need to do is to clear status message after and click on never. So this way your status will never be uh, resetted uh, or uh, cleared. So this way it, you, you will always uh, be seen as available in Microsoft Teams uh, application. Another way to do so is for example uh, doing your uh go for example to do not disturb if you want or uh go for uh, available and then you will need to start uh a meeting with yourself only yourself and that's why you will be seen as active so it won't go idle and uh at the same time you are going to uh, be set as busy or anything then change just your uh, status as you want so now i'm starting this meeting alone i just clicked on this meeting button and i am here in a team that i am alone in so i don't have any uh, other people you can uh, for example make it busy uh, seeing busy or do not disturb do it however you want and just let uh, the meeting go in and of course no one is going to know that you are in meeting and uh, also uh, you are going to be seen as available or any status that you want and it it will never go to idle or you will never be uh, seen as appear aware or idle so basically those are uh, the ways that you can do to not uh, go in idle in Microsoft Teams desktop application. Thank you for watching and see you next time.